என்ன பண்ணணும் நிறைய பாடங்கள் இருக்காங்க நிறைய டிவியில் பாடிட்டு இருக்காங்க டிப்ஸாக சொல்லுங்கள் என்ன பண்ணணும் நான் நான் முன்னாலே சொன்னேன் இந்த என்னோடய வாய்ஸ்க்கு நான் ரெஸ்பான்சிபிலிட்டி எடுத்துக்க முடியாது ஏன்னா தட் சம்திங் தட் யூ போர்ன் வித் ஸோ ஐ ஐ டோன்ட் ஐ டோன்ட் சே ஐ கேன் டேக் ரெஸ்பான்சிபிலிட்டி ஃபார் த வாய்ஸ் இட் செல்ஃப் பட் ஃபார் அப்கமிங் சிங்கர்ஸ் அஸ்பைரிங் மியூசிஷியன்ஸ் uh two things i'll say the biggest thing first is hard work uh to this day uh, i practice carnatic music for about 2 to 2 and a half hours every day uh, as long as i'm not traveling and um and that's not to say everyone has to sing only carnatic music or that's the, but practice whatever your uh mode of music training is practice every day that's the biggest thing nothing replaces that uh second is don't chase fame chase excellence just uh 2012 la adiye vandhu enakku adukapra 2014 la ennodu nindal both songs i i got to sing for my guru rahman sir um but adukaprame there was not many songs happening it was just kind of slow up it in uh but and that time la na enna panna na i just made sure every day i practiced every day i made music i was composing every day i was dedicating myself to my craft uh and because i fell in love with the process of singing with practicing with making music then things started clicking for me so um fall in love with the music not with the fame or don't idealize the fame idealize wanting to become the best musician you can be that's two and then three uh don't try to be like other people don't imitate others find your own voice find your own vision and go after that with a fiery passion i think these three things any young or old upcoming musician there's no age you can be 50 and still decide you want to sing or whatever so whatever the age it is if you're starting off just these three things is what i would say that's it uh where are we yeah. Yeah. ஸோ ரகுமன் சார் வந்து நிறைய இம்ப்ரூவைஸ் பண்ண அலோவ் பண்ணுவாங்க சிங்கர்ஸ் இப்போ ராஜா சார் கூட நீங்கள் சைக்கோ சாங் பண்ணியிருந்தீங்க ஸோ அதில் வந்து அவர் பர்டிகுலராக அந்த டியூனில் நீங்கள் கரெக்டாக பண்ணணும் அப்படிங்கிற மாதிரி டிமாண்ட் பண்ணுவாருங்கிற மாதிரி நிறைய சிங்கர்ஸ் சொல்லியிருந்தாங்க ஸோ ஹவு இஸ் த எக்ஸ்பீரியன்ஸ் ஒர்க்கிங் வித் ராஜா சார் ஒரு கரெக்ஷன் இல்லை ரஹ்மான் சார் இம்ப்ரூவைஸ் இல்லை ஓகே அவர் என்ன பண்ணுவார்னா ஹீ நோஸ் எக்ஸாக்ட்லி வர் ஹீ நீட்ஸ் ஸோ ஹீ வில் கிவ் யூ டிஃப்ரெண்ட் ஐடியாஸ் டு ட்ரை ஸோ அந்த விதத்தில் ரெக்கார்டிங் பண்ணச்சா இட் ஓன் பி அ செட் திஸ் இஸ் இட் ஹீ வில் ஹேவ் டிஃப்ரெண்ட் ஐடியாஸ் நான் அங்கே போச்சா நான் இதை ட்ரை பண்ணுறேன் சார் அது அதெலாம் நோ சான்ஸ் ஹீ இஸ் அட் த டாப் ஆஃப் த மௌண்டன் ஐம் கிளைமிங் த மௌண்டன் ஸோ தட்ஸ் வாட் ஹீ வில் சே பிகாஸ் ஹீ இஸ் லெரிங் திஸ் காம்பசிஷன் இவால்வ் இன் த ஸ்டூடியோ ஹீ ஹேஸ் அ மல்டிடியூட் ஆஃப் ஐடியாஸ் ஸோ தீஸ் ஆர் ஆல் ஐடியாஸ் கம்மிங் ஃப்ரம் ஏஆர் சார் நாட் கம்மிங் ஃப்ரம் த சிங்கர் எவர் இன்க்ளூடிங் மை செல்ஃப் தட்ஸ் ஒன் கரெக்ஷன் டூ வித் ராஜா சார் ஹீ நோஸ் எக்ஸாக்ட்லி இன்ஸ்டெட் ஆஃப் லெரிங் இட் இவால்வ் இன் த ரெக்கார்டிங் he's already envisioned every last detail of the song so that is set before the recording starts and then we record it so in that way it's different but in the specificity of what each of these legends want that's the same they know exactly what they want and they have their different processes of getting it that's the only difference two lines from one and nh please uh i'll do it at the end we'll just finish the question yeah i want to make sure i get the lyrics right so yeah yeah and yeah said Yeah, so like நீங்க பாடுற ஆல்மோஸ்ட் நைன்டி நைன் பர்சன்ட் ஆஃப் சாங்ஸ் எல்லாமே பெரிய சார்ட் பஸ்ட் ஆயிடுது ஸோ லைக் வென் யூ கெட் இன் டூ ரெக்கார்டிங் ஃபார் நியூ சாங் டஸ் திஸ் ஆட் சம் பர்டன் ஆஃப் ரெஸ்பான்சிபிலிட்டி ஆர் எக்ஸ்ட்ரா ப்ரெஷர் டு லிவ் அப் டு யுவர் ஓன் பெஞ்ச் மார்க் நோ ஐ டோன்ட் திங்க் ஸோ எவ்ரி சாங் இஸ் டிஃப்ரெண்ட் எவ்ரி அண்ட் தேர் ஐசோலேட்டட் எக்ஸ்பீரியன்சஸ் தட் ஆர் நாட் ரிலேட்டட் டு த ப்ரீவியஸ் சாங் அட் ஆல் ஐ ட்ரை நாட் டு ஐ டோன்ட் ஈவன் ரியலி செக் லைக் சார்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் ஸ்டாஃப் எனி மோர் நவ் maybe like 2 3 years ago i did but now i um i never want to get caught up in my own hype so i try to ignore all that stuff because the minute that happens then i'll start having that pressure you're talking about so it's just every song is a new experience every song is its own world and the composer has their vision for the song so the only thing i think about when i go into a recording is 
uh, what does the compo- composer expect of me? How can I give my heart and my own uh, DNA to this song to give it my life? Uh, so in that way, it's it, and I I don't think Parasha perform Parasha compose Parasha. I don't think about anything. I try to turn my mind off, so I'm like I'm blank and I'm just as present in that moment as possible. The minute I start thinking about oh, is this song going to do well? Uh, will this be as big as my last song? Then the magic leaves the room because music is not from here. It's from elsewhere, you know. So I, I try just to keep my mind shut and let the music just channel through me and do what it has to do. Yeah, and one more, like, if you have songs, you can hear the melody or some western touch like the songs. Like, like local folk, and the genre, like, do you have that? instinct to yeah one of the songs i sang for raja sir from tamil adasan vijay anthony's yeah, movie is is a folk song yeah. it's my first one i think uh, and i love the way that song sounds so i think there'll be more uh, hi sir hi. you are a singer and now a music director yes any plans to act in movies no not not right now no i don't think so i um i've kind of dedicated my life to music <laughs> he's saying we should uh raman sir um Raman sir, uh, yeah, his voice is a gift to the universe. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know. I, I won't say never, but I'm also not really a good actor. Cameras make me a little nervous. So I say that as there's all these cameras here. But no, not for now. Right now, music and only music. I put that on music director, music direction. So I don't know how much time I put it. Maybe five years from now, if you ask me the question, I can give you a better answer. So, independent music albums, uh, videos, and the other thing is interesting. I'm not sure what I'm doing. So, in the beginning of this year, I released my first self produced full length album. Yeah. Um, it was all in English. The next one I'm working on will be multilingual, it will be in Tamar and English as well. Uh, so, yeah, that's like uh, he asked in the beginning, that's how my career started. So, uh, and I think the demand for different kinds of music you know if you look at vanam kottattum songs itself the the sound of the album is very different than what you hear right now uh and i think that's going to be my role in this industry as a music director to offer a new perspective um so i'm taking the same kind of spirit and essence that i felt when i make the independent music and i'm breathing that into the cinema side um and yeah that's what i want to be able to do thank you amma my mom that's why i ask uh until now illa but ninga sonnathukku appra maybe try pannala it's not a bad idea sure i'd love to i'm always open to everything i love all forms of music um i think as a musician singer and a creative person the creative drive uh constant pursuit leading down always trying to push boundaries always trying something new um this uh being a music director itself as uh, it came at a time for me when i felt like i needed something new in my life something to push my boundaries something to really kind of push my own limits so i'm always trying to do that i never want to get too comfortable so yeah sure maybe sometime in the near future and uh, so in the show or pair all of no hit on the siddha vechadu so if you want to ask him why did he keep it i think that would be a right question for him i i can answer that uh, so i think now first place on the 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 world is in an interesting place the whole world is in an interesting place i think there's a lot of divisive energies and um and firstly sonna madri i think music is the strongest most powerful tool to spread love because music now or energy form that sonic energy it's 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 a form that i think can shake people on a very subconscious level beyond words just spoken beyond um many other actions music can molecularly kind of change the way people think and feel uh na direct away and the effect that i have seen when i do a show i've seen the way other people's music impacts me raman sir or a part of a part of coke studio london it's called nanien perenden 
Um, that song, even to this day, if I hear it, like two lines in, I'll start crying. And that's the kind of power music has. Uh, about two years ago, after every Instagram, Facebook, Twitter post, now in the all love, no hate, I started putting it as a tagline because I felt like for me personally, I wanted to remove any feelings of hatred, any feelings of jealousy, these normal human things that everyone feels, these tendencies from my own heart. So it was a way of self-cleansing. So on the process, la, uh, simultaneous, you know, the fan base one started really growing, growing, growing. So then they started seeing me use this and they also started using it. And I saw that the phrase itself had a very positive impact and it was a way for people to remember to choose love instead of hate. It sounds cliche and it sounds a bit... Um, uh, yeah, a bit cliche, but I think it's very true. Uh, it's a simple decision one can make to choose love instead of hate. So um, this show, this is my first time doing a larger scale show here in Chennai. And my goal is to spread as much love and to create a really, really positive space with the people of this beautiful city. Um, and that's really the goal uh, with this first the Feb 8th show and then the whole South India tour. Um, and... I can't wait because when you do that, you feel like you're actually changing the way the world moves, and that's the goal. Yeah. And uh, Sid, like here, yeah. yeah. And Telugu film, Parina Parisenda, Ninga Parna Par Nala Vai Kunta Purambaya, like it's a sensational chart buster, maximum views, likes. So, Angi Abdi, like uh, how's your comfort level with Telugu diction, pronunciation, and all that? Right? Um, well, Telugu is not my first or my second language, um, but I think the language is very beautiful. So it's something I'm constantly working on. Uh, with Sama Javaragamana, I was very happy, obviously, with the response. Obviously, um, it's uh, it's just a great feeling, you know. So to get the love of the Telugu-speaking audiences and to get their support is very heartening. Um, and the pronunciation is something I'm constantly working on. But my background is in Carnatic music. And uh, most Jagraj activities, or um, a lot of them are in Telugu, so I grew up singing. So the pronunciation or like the phonetics is not too foreign to me. Um, but uh, I'm always trying to improve in every area, musically, singing-wise, pronunciation-wise. So that's something that's also a constant work in progress. Uh, hi, sir. You're from the U.S. Any plans? No, no, no. Okay. I'm yes. from Chennai. I grew up in the U.S., okay. but I'm from here. From here. So you grew up there. Any plans to uh, record music and eventually win a Grammy Award? I mean, that's... Uh, if it's in God's plan, sure. I'm going to keep recording music. Uh, and my next album, like I said, will be in English. Will be in multiple languages. There will also be Tamar in it. But, um, yeah, to get that kind of recognition from something like the Grammys would be great. But uh, one thing I've learned is not to chase awards. Uh, I'd rather make an album that is super impactful, that is really embraced by people all around the world. And as a byproduct of that, if something like the Grammys happens, then amazing. Um, so I won't say it's a goal to get a Grammy. It's a goal to make an album that I can really get behind and feel super proud of. Uh, and if a claim comes from that, then um, I'm obviously going to be happy. Sridham sir, the negative different article or one or lovers or the part So, Yanak or a different on a part la amidst So, you take a Maru Arte, which is a love song, then you have Karnana Karne, which is father and daughter, Kurumba, father and son. Then, um, uh, you know, just these different kind of emotions. Uh, so, we'll perform all of those. And what I think I love about my shows and about the way me and my band perform is we don't really um anyone can come and enjoy it it's definitely for any age group from a little four or five year old to the oldest person and they can have fun uh yeah no no and the shows alone the biggest thing we do is we make sure that we perform without apology we perform without any inhibitions so if we do that, then automatica the audience also feels like they can get up and dance and move and clap. And again, from the youngest to a 19-year-old teenager who, who wants to be cool to a, you know, a 70-year-old, you know, elder person who just wants to come and have a good time and move about. There's 
no uh it's it's just a very pure energy that that gets formed in these shows and um that's what i love most about them yeah actually uh, that's not completely true i was full day on panir kare thalli pogadelana full i started at 10 am we finished by 6 pm So it's not all the way true. I I create at whatever point. Whenever the inspiration hits, we create. That's all. So Adana sonne night time matto illa. Any time he feels like making music. Ad nariya pe solranga. The full I, I don't know. Adana solrene. The biggest song I sung for air sir was done during the daytime. Macho was also done around 4 p.m. So it's I mean but maybe each creative person has their preference of when they feel like they can really uh channel you know so ma- uh, i it's it's been a different thing sometimes some of the songs i've done uh this kannatangam song which was the first single uh that i did during the daytime uh and that kind of came together over a few days then uh, one of the songs ennuir katre which just released 2 days ago that was done mostly in the night uh we i composed it in the evening time and then we finished it by let's say like 3 4 am so we worked through the night so again i don't really say this is the time i like to cuz some days i wake up and first thing in the morning i feel like going to the studio and making music other days uh day time la onnume varadhu ideas la onnume varadhu night time la suddenly something will come and we'll just go for it so it just depends on when the inspiration hits uh i i can't say i think it's any time but sid apart from recordings what did the stew performing on the stage personally or what do you feel inside when you're performing on the stage when i perform on stage again my mind is off i i'm just in another zone kind of it feels like uh another energy from elsewhere has come and i'm just channeling that and there's an interaction between me and my band members where we'll all like look at each other and there'll be this intensity where we're all sharing in this collective joy and that joy goes out to the audience so i don't really think about anything i'm just trying to uh like i said be empty it's almost like a form of meditation where you forget yourself and you just become a center for this energy to go off like the one thing i tell myself before i go on stage is be an energy center like just collect and give collect and give that's that's kind of like the idea but i don't think about anything the minute you start thinking on stage that's when the show starts going down so well that can be anything from a a cinema show independent music carnatic music all of them it's just you want to go there just be present and just uh, surrender to the moment so chinna isli music director writing romba young age le music director writing matha music director la sitsram nammalku competitor writer nu ungala paada koopida matanu bayavada matingala Oh, cool rangle super wala a keyboard but still voice is my primary when i uh, compose i'll put down some basic chords and then i'll sing ideas first and then adlend I, i evolve the song sir kannane kanne ore oru mura paadidunga sir mudichna sir kannana kanne kannana kanne en meedu saayava punana nandai punana kayal pupola neevava naan kaathu nindhen kaalangal thorum unnekam theeruma kanniray megam thorum kanni serum karkandai maaruma arari raro 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 arari raro arari raro 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 arari raro arari raro 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 arari raro arari raro kannana kanne kannana kanne thank you
சார் ஒன்று நினச்சி கேட்டிருந்தேன் பாடுறேன்னு சொல்லிட்டு ஒன் செகண்ட் ஒன் செகண்ட் நச்சு நினச்சு உருகி போனே மெழுகா நெஞ்ச உதச்சு உதச்சு பறந்து போனாழகா உன்ன நினச்சு நினச்சு உருகி போனே மெழுகா நெஞ்ச உதச்சு உதச்சு பறந்து போனாழகா யாரோ அவளோ என்னை தீண்டும் காட்டின் விரலோ யாரோ அவளோ தாளாட்டும் தாயின் குரலோ உன்ன நினச்சு நினச்சு உருகி போனே மெழுகா நெஞ்சு உதச்சு உதச்சு பறந்து போனாழகா This is actually, Feb 8th will be the first time we ever performed this song live. So we're looking forward to that. Nandik. நீங்க <laughs> இப்போ நெக்ஸ்ட் பிக் அப்படின்றது எல்லாருமே உட்காந்து யோசிச்சுட்டு இருந்தோம் ஆஃபீஸ்ல அப்போ எங்களுக்கு தெரிஞ்ச ஒரே ஒரு பிக் சமன் ஹூஸ்ரெடி சோ மச் சித் ஃபார் நோ அக்செப்டிங் திஸ் வித் அஸ் அண்ட் வெரி ஹாப்பி வி ஆர் வெரி ப்ரௌட் டு நோ ஹாவ் த ஷோ ஆன் ஆர் பிராண்ட் நாய்ஸ் அண்ட் கிரீன்ஸ்ல இந்த ஒரு பெரிய ஆப்பர்ச்சுனிட்டி மாதிரி நாங்க பாக்குறோம் அண்ட் இந்த ஷோ is go- is going to be the massive is going to be big it is going to be the greatest show because we have one of the this generation's greatest singer sid sid i idhuk mel na pesanum avashyam kediyadhu ivar solvaru ennoda unniyum na ellarkum romba romba thanks and unga support idhe mari engal kuduthirunga naangala engalal mudinja varaikkum engaloda valaigal ellame correct ah panniterukom thanks good uh happy to see all you here uh, i enakena na i think music or powerful on a tool uh, to spread positivity to spread love and ipo in the time la i think it's the most important tool uh, to spread love uh my thanks to noise and grains for for putting this together uh, it's going to be one of the most memorable shows for me and my band i'm sure for everyone that's there and for all of you uh, again thank you so much uh, chennai சென்னை தான் என்னோட ஹோம் இங்கே தான் நான் சென்னையில் பிறந்தேன் ஐ குரோப் இன் தி யூஎஸ் பட் ஐ ஆல்வேஸ் ஃபீல் லைக் மை ரூட்ஸ் ஆர் ஹியர் இன் த சிட்டி ஹேஸ் ஹேஸ் அக்செப்டட் மீ கிவ் மீ சோ மச் லவ் ஸோ திஸ் ஷோ இஸ் அவர் வே டு கிவ் பேக் டு த பீப்புள் ஆஃப் சென்னை வீ கேன் வெயிட் அண்ட் இட்ஸ் கேன் பி ஃபுல் ஆஃப் மியூசிக் லவ் அண்ட் கிரேட் கிரேட் எனர்ஜி என்னென்ன லாங்குவேஜ் எத்தனை பாட்டுனா ஷோ கோ ஃபார் அபவுட் த்ரீ ஹவர்ஸ் So, in that time, I will be able to play the part of the part. So, maybe around 30-35 songs. Uh, languages will, will span all my languages. Mostly Tamil, lots of Telugu, some Malayalam songs I've sung. Uh, maybe one or two Hindi songs. But mostly Tamil, Telugu and then those few Malayalam songs. Now, I've also done a lot of compositions in English. So, we'll throw in a couple of those. So, it'll span. Are there highlights? Are you going to play any other part? Uh, the, we're planning now, so everyone will see when the show happens. Sir, do you want to sing a senior singer? 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 Do you want to sing a
அது தெரியல ஒரு ஜஸ்ட் இந்த ப்ராசஸ் ஆஃப் கன்செப்ஷுவலைசிங் த ஷோ பாசிபிளி ஹோப்ஃபுல்லி மேபி தட் வில் பி நைஸ் ஓகே இதுல வந்து உங்க பாடல்கள் மட்டும் பாட போறீங்களா இல்ல மற்ற இசையமைப்பாளர்கள் இசையமைத்த பாடல்கள் எல்லாம் பாட போறீங்களா இல்ல வேற சாங்ஸ்லாம் இருக்கும் சோ என்னோட ஷோ பாத்தீங்கன்னா இட் வில் ஹேவ் மை சாங்ஸ் ஐ ஹேவ் சாங் ஃபார் ஃபில்ம் and besides that yenake enna songs nariya pidichirukena like nila kaigiradhu we sing a lot um lots of ayasha songs from the 90s are some of my favorite songs so they mostly irukum and we'll try some new things as well couple songs we've never performed before we'll also premiere here on the bait okay poduva idu pondra or nigachigal la vandu velinaattu kalanjargalukku vandu adhigamaana vaayppugal tharuvaanga neenga eppadi adhaavadhu musician side la musician side la enoda band set i perform with the same band every time uh 2016 lende in the ore band da so they're like my brothers they're like my family and we perform together so we have that chemistry on stage together so it'll be the same band as always so in the february 14 la lovers day adukku munnala and the function nadathringa kadalargal la edavathu serappu thallupadi edhum unda ticket la illa adle inor question add panunga anga ninga yaro propose pandra plan andha mari edhavathu iruka adhu kuda ketukku full show music focus na all that uh and also band full band members la chennai da they're from here my brothers from here like myself okay ninga ipa samiba kalama vande naattu pura kalanjargal la kural koduthittu varinga inda ipa paada pora nigalchila avungalukku edavadhu vaayppugal kudukka poringala andha mari paadalgal la paada irukringala definitely uh, again who we're going to bring on stage who else will be there with me we're still deciding but it will uh, definitely highlight that as well மயில்தோகைடும் மனப்பாடமாயுரையாடல் நிகழும் விழிநீரும் வீணாக இமை தாண்ட கூடாதன துளியாக நான் சேர்த்தேன் கடலாக கண்ணானதே மறந்தாலும் நான் உன்னை நினைக்காத நாளில்லையே பிரிந்தாலும் என் அன்பு ஒரு போதும் பொய்யில்லையே தேங்க்யூ சார் மியூசிக் டைரக்டர் ஆர் எங்கே நாளைக்கு மனித சார் இது அந்த சாங் வந்து கச்சேரியில் இருக்குமா ஆ டெஃபினட்டாக இருக்கும் ஒரு ஐ டோன் நோ விட் சாங்ஸ் பட் ஒர்க் டெஃபினெட்லி இன்க்ளூட் சம் ஆஃப் தோஸ் சாங்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் தட் ஆல்பம் very excited tomorrow banam kotta to mallow is coming out so my first debut as a music composer on the time lay the show is happening so it feels like many blessings are happening at one time so we'll definitely perform a few of those songs as well amma shri satyanarayanam ஸ்மே நீத்தம் ஸ்ரீசத்தாயணம் உபாஸ்மே நீத்தம் சத்தியம் சர்வம் விஷ்ணுமயி ஹரி சூப்பர் சார் தேங்க்யூ தேங்க்யூ இஸ் இன்டிபெண்டன்ட் மியூசிஷியன் சோ எவ்ரி இன்டிபெண்டன்ட் மியூசிஷியன் வாண்ட் டு லவ் फ्रॉम பீப்பிள் சோ யூ டுயிங் லாட் ஆஃப் ஸ்டேஜ் ஷோஸ் ஹவ் டு யூ ஃபீல் நவ் அபௌட் தி ரெஸ்பான்ஸ் ரெஸ்பான்ஸ் फ्रॉम தி ஆடியன்ஸ் बिकॉज லாட் ஆஃப் பீப்பிள்ஸ் ஃபால் இன் லவ் வித் யூ இட்ஸ் a blessing uh I started releasing music in 2009 through YouTube. I was in college, so I was making music in my dorm room in Boston. And when I was doing that, I was just doing it because I loved the music and I I wanted to get my voice out. Uh so in the journey ipti pohona, I never actually it's surpassed my dreams. Um and 
to be able to have the love of the fans to perform in front of thousands of people and um it's beautiful and one thing i'll say is even to this day that same love that same passion for music that was there when i was a college student in the dorm room it's still there now it's only grown so it's a blessing i'm humbled and i was also say even though i've been in the industry now for 8 years it still feels like it's just the beginning there's so much more that's to come